I think that when I'm here, I'm reminded of what this journey is really all about, which is the emptying out of my mind and the surrender to the profound stillness that that is my natural state. I think that in, in most parts of the world where there's lots of activity and cities and lots of people, you know, it's easy to forget. It's, it's like the ego made all of that as a distraction against the truth. And when you're in a place like this, which is just absolutely you know, stunning in terms of its beauty and the stillness, then it reminds you of, of the peace and the stillness that's within yourself. It reminds me of, of, of what is truly valuable. And that's what this place is so helpful for. It invites the mind to rest, to drop way down deep into the stillness that is available. I'm just very grateful that, that this place exists seemingly in, within the dream as a as a symbol of the stillness and the reverence and the devotion. I think I've always been attracted to monasteries, but you know, this is the this is the one monastery I feel in the world that is is completely devoted to to the non-dualistic truth that is shared by Jesus in A Course in Miracles. And it's quite a gift. <laughs>